I did one part at a time and finished my model of the solar system. Check it out! Whoa! Now that's some light show! It's out of this world! <laughs> <laughs> Clumsy Cat Boy! Very nice! Everyone's got their science fair projects. But where's Connor with our model volcano? Being careful, I hope. It's really fragile. <laughs> Connor, watch out! Don't worry, I've got it. <gasps> Let us help you get through the door. Thanks, but I'm okay. Careful! See, I've got it. Oh. Whoa! <laughs> uh, 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 whoa! <gasps> huh? Told you I've got it. <gasps> Huh? Whoa! Grab it! <gasps> yeah! Yay! You're really clumsy today, Connor. You're slipping and tripping over everything. <gasps> Whoa! Careful! Whoa. Ouch! What? <gasps> For you. <gasps> He's not the only one. Whoa. I'm not clumsy, it's these other kids. I bet someone knocked that garbage can in my way. Hmm. This is way too much clumsiness to be just a coincidence. We need to find out who's behind this. PJ Masks, we're on our way! Into the night! Uh, into the... Uh, into the... Uh. Oops. <laughs> to save the day! Night in the city. And a brave band of heroes is ready to face fiendish villains to stop them messing with your day. <laughs> Amaya becomes... Owlette! Yeah! Greg becomes... Becomes Cat Boy. Whoa! I'm okay. See? <clears throat> Let's check out some footage from around town today. <gasps> Definitely making people wobbly. But what? I don't know. But they must feel terrible being so clumsy. Whoa! I'm okay. Look! On the other side of town! That's over by the library. To the cat car! Whoa! Uh, can we take the gecko mobile instead? Yeah, you seem a little, uh, unsure on your feet. No oh, way! I meant to get in the cat car like that. It's, uh, my new hurry up technique. Watch out, trash! Maybe someone else should drive. Guys, I don't know why you think I'm being so clumsy. I've totally got this. Look! Romeo's lab! Romeo was behind this. Time to hit it. Cat speed. Wait, let me get out first. Protect us from outside the cat car. Uh, maybe I should help. No need. Let's pounce. Oh. Oops. Wrong button. No chance, PJ Masks. Now, which kind of clumsy will suit this sticky lizard best? Slippy, trippy, twisty, turny. No! Bumble fingers! Perfect! Just checking 
assuming that gecko's okay from down here. So, guys, what's going on? I don't know. I can't hold on to the pole anymore. <laughs> of course you can't. Thanks to me, you've got bubble fingers. <gasps> so that's some kind of clumsy ray. Not some kind. The most genius clumsy ray ever. Oh, no. Gecko's been zapped. Yeah, because you won't admit that you're zapped, too. Your clumsy driving is the only reason Gecko got out of the cat car. Clumsy? Me? No way. Check out my graceful cat moves as I disable that ray. Super cat speed! No, cat boy, wait! Whoa! Huh? Huh, maybe he wasn't zapped. Hmm. <gasps> Super cat speed! Oh! Protect Owlette from the ray. She's the only one who hasn't been hit. Other than me. But let's do it. I'll deflect the ray with this sign. Ha, huh, Bumble Fingers. Let me help you. It'll be easy for me since I'm not clumsy. Whoa! Ah! Everyone okay? Yeah. What? No! Now you're clumsy too, bird brain. My rays make you twisty turning, so you'll never go in a straight line again. Ah, I can't even fly straight or stop. Whoa. Whoa. Ah. This is a catastrophe. You two are really clumsy. How are we going to unzap you? Why won't you just admit that you're clumsy too? Because I'm not. I'm as graceful as a cat. Whoa. Ah. First? Yes, last night while he was sleeping. And now I'm going to make everyone in the world clumsy so I can rule them all! <gasps> oh no! And there's nothing you can do about it. Bye, Super Stumblers! So you were clumsified before either of us. Yes, but no! <sighs> I guess I must have been. And because I wouldn't admit it, now we're all zapped. I'm really sorry. Oh, Catboy, it's okay. Really? Yeah, but what can we do? We're going to be slipping, sliding, and stumbling forever. We're still the PJ Masks. We'll find a way past it and stop Romeo. It's time to be a hero. Here we come, Romeo. Yeah! <gasps> it just might take a little longer than usual. Concentrate and help each other focus. Okay, steer straight. No, straight! <gasps> you come back from all clumsy, PJ Masks? Oh! Looks like you have enough already. Ha <laughs> no, We need a better plan! It's out of control. Let's get out! Too, Romeo, you'll have to reverse everyone's clumsiness. No way! I may be slippy trippy, twisty turny, and have fumble fingers, but I'll never destroy my beautiful clumsy ray. Ha! Huh. So you reverse the clumsiness by destroying the ray. No, that's not what I meant! Whoa! Too late. You've given it away now, Romeo. Whoa! Ha! <laughs> ha. You're too clumsy! Watch me make my getaway! This way, the weak lab! Oh, do as I say, you naughty lab! Romeo's too clumsy to drive away! Whoa! But how are we gonna stop him like this? I've got it! When we tried not being clumsy, we were even clumsier! We crashed the cat car! 
right? right? So we need to use our clumsiness. Bumble fingers, twisty turny, and slippy trippy. Like clumsy power. Cool chameleon. Whoa. <laughs> but Romeo's lab is really zigzaggy, so we'll have to time it carefully. Here it comes. Ready and go! Super Gecko Bumble Fingers! Slippy Trippy Cat Roll! Twisty Turny Power! Super Bumble Fingers! Wait for the ray to wear off. Oh, phew. Wait, I'm walking in a straight line again. Ooh, you PJ masks ruined everything! PJ masks all shout a ray! Cause in the night we save the day! Nice to see a regular science fair and not some mad scientist experiment. Amaya, Connor, the teacher says we need to move our volcano over there. I've got it. It's not like I'm clumsified anymore, so I've totally got it. Uh. Uh. Ah! <gasps> okay, maybe I haven't got it. <laughs> Okay, Greg, you're going to recite a poem for us, right? Uh, in the night I heard a noise. It sounded really squeaky. I thought it was some squawky birds beeping through their squeepies. Huh? Wait, uh, I mean squeaking through their teepees. <laughs> Calm down, children. Greg's doing just fine. Take your time, Greg. It sounded like some sporty... No! Squawky birds sweeping through their beakies. No! <laughs> Saved by the bell. It's okay, Greg. You can try another poem tomorrow. Huh? I thought I was done with that silly poem, but now I have to do another one. Don't worry. You'll do great tomorrow. Yeah, you'll nail it, Greg. Easy. It's not easy. It's embarrassing. Oh, I don't want to have to read another poem out loud again, ever. Whoa, what is that? What's going on? Hey, my voice is getting quieter, but I have to read my poem tomorrow. <gasps> no voice, no poem. What are you doing, Greg? Your voice went into that box? <laughs> There's only one nighttime villain who can make a machine like that. Romeo. PJ Masks, we're on our way! Into the night to save the day! Night in the city, and a brave band of heroes is ready to face fiendish villains to stop them messing with your day. Connor becomes... Boy. <laughs> Amaya becomes Owlette. Greg becomes
take the cat car. It's the fastest. We'll get your voice back soon, Gecko. Cat ears! <laughs> this way! Lab. And that's the machine that took your voice, Gecko. Let's sneak around back. Cool. Romeo has no idea we're here. Hey, good looking. Now's our chance. Use your super lizard grip to scale down the wall and sneak onto the lab. This is our easiest mission yet. Grab it, Gecko. Get your voice. Go for it. Huh? The PJ Pests ate my dust. <laughs> Gecko. Huh? <sighs> You're okay, but. Why didn't you grab the box? It was right there. Never mind. We'll get it next time. I wonder why Romeo took your voice anyway. PJ Max! Gecko! You got your voice back! Pussycat and Featherbrain, you're not very smart. Hey! That's not very nice. <laughs> you are my hero. Romeo! <laughs> no! Gecko didn't get his voice back. Romeo still has it. And he's using it, too. To the cat car! Because you're just silly do-gooders. You can't even find the end of your nose. Not like Romeo. He's a total genius. Yes, a genius. Not a wizard like a sticky finger stinkaroo like me. <laughs> sticky fingered stinkaroo. I'm a genius at making up insults. And when Kitty Cat and Bird Brain come for Lizard Boy's voice, I'll get theirs too. Once I have all those PJ Masks voices, they'll never be able to make plans to stop me again! <laughs> what a brilliant plan! Why, thank you. I thought it was a pretty good one too. Okay, Gecko, we'll deal with Romeo. You take care of the machine. Mr. Super Genius, Giant Brain. Smartest of the smart. Can we have Gecko's voice back? It would mean so much. Giant Brain? That does sound like me. Yes, you're the brainiest evil genius ever. Yeah, we could never expect to beat you. <laughs> you can try another poem tomorrow. A new poem. <laughs> Trick! Of course! Romeo, your, your genius, genius is untouchable. By my cat's whiskers, Gecko, coming unstuck isn't like you. Wait a minute. Are you trying to get out of doing your poem tomorrow? Come on, let's just find Romeo. <laughs> I just love this lizardy loser. Romeo is number one. I agree. He is the greatest inventor that ever lived. Cool. Oh, Gecko, I love the things you say. Who makes the world a better place? Romeo. Who has the most handsome face? Romeo. Don't worry, Gecko. We'll make him be quiet. I've got a plan. I'm heading up into the air. You guys cover me in the cat car. Got it. Who can ever be beat? Romeo. Who has lovely, um, feet? Romeo. This is even worse than having to read a poem at school, isn't it?
Don't worry, I'm okay. Hmm. I'm tired of only having one PJ mask voice. Time to get all three. <gasps> no, I'm losing my voice. He's taking our voice. Does this mean that Romeo the genius has all of our voices? It's because he's so awesome. But we're not. Without our voices, we'll never be able to work together to defeat him. And all because Gecko didn't take his voice back when he could. R-O-M-E-O, Romeo! Oh, what's that, Gecko? Oh, you think it's time to be a hero. In your dreams, you loopy lizard! <laughs> Imagine all the naughty things I can do with these voices. And those PJ Pests will get the blame! Oh, this is even more genius than I thought!